What's up, gang? Not sure when y'all gonna see this clip, but I literally have not been on camera for a while because for one, my skin is like breaking out and I have not been feeling like blogging. I really don't feel like myself. So that's um, a video for another day. But I just went to check my P.O. box and I wanted to show you guys what I got. I got a package from James and Lisa. I'm sure Lisa sent it, but I just love James and Lisa. And she already knows she never had to send me anything. And it was for my birthday. The box is my P.O. box. It says fragile. And then on the box, it says happy birthday, happy summer. So I wanted to just pop in and show y'all this. Um, the first thing that I'm opening is a card and it says Danny Gang. Y'all already know. Y'all, look at this card. This is so freaking cute. So I'm gonna go. <gasps> Y'all. So the first thing I see in my card is a Starbucks card and a Nintendo Switch or a Nintendo eShop card. Oh my gosh. It says, wishing you the sun, the moon, and the stars. Happy birthday. Send a love with a small gift for your special day. Hope it's a good one. Happiest of birthdays. Live it up. Bookmark custom made by Gabby at Gabby. Let's read on IG from your girl Lisa and James and Lisa. Happy birthday, Danny Gang. Y'all, this is so freaking cute. Like, girl, you do not have to do that. Then she sent me a $10 card um, to give me a new game on my Nintendo Switch. Thank you. And she also sent me a Starbucks card because y'all already know. Oh my gosh, it says five for you, five for Bay, or all for ten for you to Danny. And it has um ten dollars on it. Oh, they even thought about Bay. Just for that, I am gonna give him his drink, y'all. It's like a box full of goodies, y'all, like legit goodies. Ooh. I like a candle. It smells so good. She sent me a Yankee candle and lilac blossom, y'all. How freaking sweet, y'all. So this is the first thing that I got. A candle, y'all know I love candles, okay? This is so fun, like actually opening up gifts. I wanna cry. She also sent me a neon bomb. This is a pink grapefruit bath fizzler with a neon surprise inside. So she sent me a bath bomb and y'all, I've been working and moving, so I definitely need um, to take a bath. So she sent me a bath bomb. <gasps> Girl, you, you really didn't have to. She sent me some Hemp's Berry Punch Snow Cone Herbal Moisturizing Lotion. And it's limited edition because I've never seen this. Hemp's is such a good freaking brand. I have never seen this Berry Punch Snow Cone. I'm gonna have to open it and smell it, but she sent me this lotion. Oh, I got a whole thing of lip gloss. So I got some Stunner Body Lotion. Girl. Some body lotion, and then she also threw in three lip glosses. Y'all know I love a gloss. So she got, uh, it was from Victoria's Secret, Kiwi Blush, Candy Baby, and Strawberry Fizz. Girl. These are so freaking pretty. So this is what these look like. If I can get them all together. Thank you. So I got three new lippies and a purse lotion. It is so crazy. It's so crazy, like, I'm not gonna cry. <laughs> it's so crazy how much of y'all know me. Like, this is literally my favorite sugar scrub. I've never seen it in this size. This is the Tria Coco Colada Shea Sugar Scrub. Y'all, this is my favorite sugar scrub period hands down and the fact that y'all watch me and the fact that lisa knows that like that is top tier so she threw in a sugar scrub which is so cute y'all my favorite one this is very fitting we talk about books all the time okay. so she sent me a book and it's it's by lisa gardner and it's called before she disappeared 
y'all already know by the title, I'm already captivated. Um, so she sent me a book and then she also threw, she threw in a customized bookmark that matches. And she said the bookmark was um, by Gabby. Um, let's read. I'll put her information in the description box and on the screen. This is absolutely gorgeous. Like, are you kidding me? Like, I don't deserve this. Like, huh? That literally just made my day because y'all, I have not been feeling like myself. I know y'all have noticed. Thank you, James and Lisa. Thank you, Lisa, so much. Listen, you don't know what that just did to my day. Like, you literally brightened my day. Thank you. Sincerely, like, from the bottom of my heart. Like, thank you very much. <sighs> it's Friday. Happy Friday. I need you guys to know that I'm now simply members of the Danny Gang. If you want to be a member of the Gang Gang Gang, like, come subscribe, hit that bell. After you hit the bell, put your fists up. Y'all gotta fight me. After you fight me and you jumped in, you're a lifetime member. Period. 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 Nothing left to say, like, period. 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 Yeah. Period. 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 So, yeah, y'all, I had to get up early and go to the DMV and get all that situated. Um, so, that's done, and I'm happy about it. Now, I'm just about to run my errands. I know Lisa had messaged me on Instagram and asked me if I went and got my package. And I'm about to message her back like, sis, yes, I did. Actually, no, I'm not. I'm going to wait till I get home, and I'm just going to take a picture of it, post it on my story. Like, sis, thank you so very much, because that was the most thoughtful thing ever. Um... But yeah, so it's Friday. Um, I'm about to just run errands or whatever. Um, I did wash my hair last night and I just put some product in it. I'm going to show y'all the products that I've been using in my hair um, today. <laughs> I promise. Um, when I get home, I'll show y'all the products that I'm using in my hair. Um, but for now, I'm about to run to Target because I got to make a return. And then... Um, I got a couple birthday things that I need to pick up, like... I never got my birthday gift from Ulta. I never went and got my birthday cookie from Crumble. So, I'm just about to go get my birthday stuff. And then I'm just going to chill and relax. Later on tonight, it's date night. So, we're going to go see Space Jam with LeBron. Um, y'all know, if y'all don't know, babe, love LeBron. So, I'm going to, we're going to go see Space Jam. We already got our tickets and everything. Um, so yeah, I'm super excited about that. But yeah, it's Friday, y'all know, it's my off day. This is my day off from the gym. I'll be back in the gym tomorrow. But I try to give myself one or two days off from the gym. So, since I've been going consistently all week, I'm going to just go ahead and take today off. But I had to come and just open up that gift with y'all because the fact that I'm still celebrating my birthday and it's July 16th is a madness. So, thank y'all so much. But anyway, I'm going to try to get back into the vlogging spirit. Don't know where my gumption and drive went, but I'm going to try to get it back. Um, but yeah, I do have on this oversized shirt. I just wore this to the DMV. I'm definitely going to change it to something cute for date night. Um, but yeah, I just rocking this shirt that I got from Shein real quick because I had to go to the DMV early. And now we're about to head to Target and make a return. I think I had told y'all I might have cut it out, but I had got a couple silk pillowcases because y'all know. Well, if y'all don't know, Babe also cut his locks off. He cut his hair. Um, so we both are rocking these short little hair styles, haircuts or whatever. And um, I have picked up some satin pillowcases from Target. Now he used his and once he opened his and was using it, I was like, oh yeah, no, I don't like that. So I never opened mine. So I'm gonna go ahead and return it. And while I'm in there, look around, but yeah, y'all. Have you ever just not felt like yourself or not felt like posting or not felt like not even just content creators, just people in general, like everybody. Have you ever felt like not in the mood to like post or create or anything? Yeah, the last month or so, I have just not been in the mood. Y'all been getting like one video a week, maybe. And it's been a struggle to post that. So um, just bear with me. I'm trying to get my bearings together and I'm trying to get like back on board and get motivated again. Um, so that's why I told myself I wanted to like just go back to keto for a week 
and see if I like that. Maybe film some what I eat in the keto days. See if I can get like that motivation to film back because I'm not sure what happened to it, but it's gone. And that sucks because y'all know YouTube has been a huge part of my life for years now. And I just have lost that motivation. And I think primarily because now I'm working, y'all know I have a full-time job and then um, I'm in a new state you know I've only been here a couple months and everything so I just think everything hit me hard um, I've been on my new job for a couple months now I'm still getting acclimated so it's just a lot going on so yeah y'all thank you so much for bearing with me thank y'all for still supporting me I'm gonna try to get back on the high horse because y'all know I don't quit but I just was feeling kind of like I don't know conflicted with filming y'all let me know down below if you're a content creator or if you just post frequently on Instagram have you ever felt like just taking a break or a hiatus because that's literally how I feel right now but I know y'all love me I know y'all miss me and I want to be there for y'all so we're about to go to Target and I'll see you guys in the next clip y'all they redoing my Target it don't even say Target but guess what I know it's Target <laughs> so anyway we been to head in here and return this oh let me show y'all I don't know if I showed y'all. This was the satin pillowcase that I got. I got two of them. And without having hair, your scarf slips off very easily. So I thought having a satin pillowcase under it would be nice because one thing about it, I want my hair to stay nice even though it's short. But anyway, it was a silk pillowcase by Annie. And yeah, it's a no for me. So y'all thinking about silk pillowcase do not buy this one anyway let's go Ooh, so y'all know how uh, target always got starbucks first thing i see they got new cups these look really pretty i don't need another cup but this is what these look like $15. Ooh, I like these. They also have these for hot drinks. I've always wanted a black one. This this is giving me very much so tic-tac-toe. So it's a no for me. All right. So I know I told y'all I was going to show y'all what I've been using in my hair when I got home. But I'm in Target and they have them. So I've been using the Miss Jessie's Honey Curls and also the Miss Jessie's Coily Custard. So what I'll do is I'll put the Honey Curls in first and kind of just rub the palm of my hand around my hair the way that my hair grows. And then I'll go back on top with the Coily Custard. Um, the Honey Curls is mainly, it's yellow and its main ingredient is honey. Um, y'all, sweet almond oil and honey smell both of these smell damn good and then the coily custard has agave and coconut oil so yeah i'll go in with the honey curls then the coily custard on top so if you have short hair like me give me what y'all use this has really been working for me it's giving me that wet look that i like on short hair so i'm really loving it but yeah y'all can leave your suggestions down below but this is what i've been using this is what i used on my birthday when y'all told me my hair was popping, that's what I used. All right, gang, so I made it back home from Target and I also went to Subway to grab myself and babe some lunch. But yeah, I'm about to take everything out of the box and put it in its new home. I'm just super excited. So yeah, again, thank you so much, James and Lisa. Like, I'm blown away at this gift. Um, thank you. And babe says thank you too because I will give him $5 so he can get him a drink too. So thank you so much for that. Um, I also was just re-looking at this. Like, this is so pretty. 
but anyway really quickly um i'll show you guys what i got from target so from target i got this derma e acne deep pore cleansing wash y'all my face is breaking out really bad i'm not sure what it is i'm not doing things too much different i'm still drinking water and stuff but i guess just because it was my birthday and i was drinking a lot of alcohol and wasn't eating the best my skin is breaking out so y'all know i love the trader joe's um face wash but this was on sale for seven bucks it's originally like 17 so i went ahead and picked this up it's the derma e acne deep pore cleansing wash with um active salicylic acid with tea tree and chamomile and it is for anti-acne it's vegan so i'm really excited to try this out and then also i just picked up this um true complexion hd corrector um in orange by black radiance for when i'm doing my makeup so yeah that's all that i got all right, gang, so, hey, Google, stop. All right, gang, so, listen, <laughs> um, if you, uh, listen, it's 849 and about to head to the movies. Like I told y'all, it was date night. We're about to go see Space Jam. Um, I was just all live for an hour on Instagram, and it got real. I'll probably put um, some clips in right now. But yeah, y'all, um, I'm going to talk more next week on like how I've been like really feeling and stuff like that. But being on live was lit. Um, I did do my hair with the Miss Jessie's products I showed y'all. I did a little bit of makeup. I have on this shirt that I got from Target and it just says embrace all these things. And we're about to go to the movies. We're running a tad bit late. Not because of me, because clearly I'm here and dressed. But we're running a tad bit late, but I am going to go ahead and um, play the clips of me on live, give y'all a little brief synopsis of how I've been feeling, and then I'll see you guys at the movies. That I got from James and Lisa, um, this was a little bit of it. I got this care package from James and Lisa from my for my birthday, y'all, in my P.O. box. And when I say and when I say that literally lifted my spirits, I think this clip is also going to show you guys some stuff I got from Target, but I'm just let it play. But anyway, I got this freaking um, box in the mail from James and Lisa. And when I say that sparked something in me, because I'm like, yo, you have never met James nor Lisa. You don't know where they live, but you got people sending you gifts from out of town out of state they don't even know you for your birthday like they sent me this birthday box with candles um that's what i got from target but i'm gonna just show that clip one more time but yeah they sent me a birthday box full of all my favorite things and it's so crazy it was motivating because i'm like you know me from youtube you know me from social media so for you to know what i like what i use the candles a Nintendo Switch card, lotion, my favorite sugar scrub. Like, for you to know those things about me, it just really touched me. And it almost, like, if you watch the vlog that you're going to see on Monday, it was so freaking sweet. Like, in the vlog, I literally was crying because I'm like, for someone who doesn't even know me, like, in the flesh, like, personally, to send me such an amazing birthday gift and i have people in my life that know me family members and everything and I, you know i didn't even so much as get a birthday card or a happy birthday until like 10 p.m it's like wow to know that i have supporters that send me things like this in my p.o box that made me cry y'all like bath bombs, candles, Nintendo Switch cards so I can get a new game, lotion, sugar scrubs. Like I said, I literally was crying. So um, shout out to Lisa. I think she's still in here. But that's what motivated me to pick up my camera and vlog today because I'm like, people are watching. I actually do inspire people. So if you think you don't inspire people because you don't have 100,000 subscribers or whatever you do 
you do inspire people. And just like Bad Gal said, she's at the gym. She got off her machine to watch me. What? That is inspiring. Like, when, when things like this happen, it sparks, like, something in me. And I'm just like, okay, Danny, let's get it. Because it was very sweet. And my P.O. box is always in my bio. And I get things in my P.O. box all the time. But what Lisa sent me today and the fact that I was feeling so discouraged today. And I think the package has been there for days. But I really just was able to go get it today because I'm off. Like, I'm exhausted during the week. So today I was like, let me go get my package. She we all connected. Like, yep, we're all connected at some point. We are all connected. And I just, I don't know. Coming on live tonight was really good for me. And I'm very happy I did. Hopefully, I inspired somebody. Yes, I need to hear this, period. Hey, Cargina, yes. Like, period. We can't, we're human. And especially us as, like, women and black women and all of that. Like, we are strong, but sometimes we need a little bit of encouragement too. And I just feel like, I don't know, something just came over me. and was like, get on live, talk about how you feel, encourage some people and go from there. Because myself, I battle with crap every day, like every day, just like y'all do. And the thing is, I know people that have kids and, you know, married and all of that. Like I said, adding kids or animals or pets into it with full-time jobs and try to content create and trying to make sure you have a healthy relationship with your spouse and trying to make sure your kids are happy, prosper. Like that could be a lot. So us as women or people in general, if we try to keep all that in, we could just explode. So I don't know. Something just came over me. It was like, sis, get on live. Like somebody needs to hear it. I needed to hear that I've been discouraged all week. Exactly. Like, we just got to grind. I've been discouraged myself, not even all week. I've been a little bit discouraged for the last month. So I just had to put my big girl pennies on and tell myself, like, sis, get it together. Embrace kindness. Embrace. No, let me stop. But <laughs> I really did have to get on here and just tell myself that. And I'm glad that I'm able to inspire y'all and tell y'all, too, because y'all, listen. But. If y'all ever feel like y'all need to talk or if y'all ever need anything, DM me. Michael B. Jordan, the actor. I was just getting some popcorn and then this cat rat. We couldn't get Michael A. <laughs> Show who you really are, notorious P.I.G. big lots because i have a coupon oh this is cute i have a birthday coupon y'all know big lots do coupons all the time but i have a birthday coupon so i'm legit like running around trying to use all my coupons because y'all i still have so many coupons from my birthday like Big lots. I have to go get my gift from Ulta. I have a crumble cookie coupon. 
to get a free cookie so yeah i'm just about to spend the day running around getting all of my coupons and birthday gifts that i didn't get a couple of them expired but it's okay like i had one for i can't even remember at home or something and it expired but i have a birthday coupon for big lots so i wanted to come in here if y'all don't have a big lots it's kind of like a ross mixed with like a home goods as y'all can see it's like a lot of home decor and stuff but it's more affordable than home goods um they have air fryers all type of coffee pots and appliances and stuff and then just like home stuff i really 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 want to redo our front door with like a plan outside and a welcome sign and stuff like that but I did not get it when they were trending. Um, so, yeah, now I can't find any tall welcome signs. But, anyway, good morning. Happy Saturday. Um, this is a weekend vlog, so I'm going to just keep the vlog rolling. I am going to go to the gym, so I just have on my Nikes, some tights, and a little shirt. Um, I'm going to go to the gym after I finish running my errands. So, yeah. Happy Saturday, y'all. Um... Just wanted to come and say hey open up the vlog Ooh, so i kind of want to put all of our spices in jars like this but i bet you the top doesn't oh it does <gasps> should i change our spices to these jars but the thing is they only have four and we have more than four spices but these are cute all right if I find something, I'll come back. All right, y'all. So I told y'all I want to redo our front door. I found this little sign. What y'all think? I think I'm going to get it and just see how it looks. I also want to do like the little layered um, rug look. I'll put a picture on the screen. But I kind of want to just put this like up against the wall and then bring our snake plant out. So I think I'm going to play around with it today. Um, this is $15. It's big. It's like as tall as me. But I do have a 20% off birthday coupon. So I think I'm going to get it and just see how it looks. And if I like it, I'll keep it. If not, I'll bring it back. So I think it's cute. All right, y'all. The next store I think I'm going to go in is this consignment store. It's called On Consignment. I've never been in here, but it looks pretty interesting. So let's check it out. So yeah, I'm in Ulta to get my birthday gift. And as soon as I walk in the door, I see this Derma E, which I just purchased at Target for like $7. And in here it's like 20 plus. So that's lit. Um, I used it last night and I used it this morning. I like the way it feels. I'm gonna do some more research on it, but I like it. I don't really need anything else. I just came to get my birthday gift, but I'm gonna go ahead and look around. And it's like a ghost town. Uh, baby. Uh, where did these niggas be at when they say they going all this and all that? Tired of beefing you bones, you can't even pay me enough to react. Been waking up in the crib, but sometimes I don't even know where I'm at. Please don't pay that nigga songs in this party, I can't even listen to that. Anytime that I run into somebody, it must be a victory lap. Hey, Shotty come sit on my lap. Hey, they say I'm juicy, just snap. This in between us is not like a store, this isn't a closable gap. Hey, I see some niggas attack, and don't end up making it back. That day at the crib, going crazy down bad. What they had didn't last, damn, baby. Yeah. Where did these niggas be at when they say they doing all this and all that? end up picking the living proof no frizz nourishing styling cream so yeah this was my birthday gift nourishes and lightly conditions for smooth frizz free styles apply generously and comb through so definitely going to give this a try probably the next time i wash my hair um but yeah it was free i got my birthday gift so on to the next spot all right gang so i made it back home and i'm just show you guys a couple things i got at walmart nothing major but y'all know i always share with y'all what i find new finds and stuff like that so here's a little overview of what i got nothing major so y'all i have been well babe and i both have been trying to find quick ways to make dinner um in my last vlog i kind of said 
we were doing dinner a little bit differently starting last week so um now we split up the days for dinner which is kind of fun so i know like what days i'm responsible for dinner he knows what dates he's responsible for res responsible for dinner and it's just it's pretty it's pretty nice because one person is not responsible every single time and vice versa. So, um, these can be for either one of us. I just picked up like easy things, um, uh, cause we both work full time and stuff like that. So I just picked up a couple things that we could, um, both utilize when it's our cooking night. So I have used these before. It's the marinade in the bag. I got sweet teriyaki and then I also got smoky mesquite. So this is what it looks like. And basically all you do is clean your meat, open this bag, put the meat in it and it marinates, um, you can leave it in there for as long as you want, at least 30 minutes overnight, whatever. And then you can grill it, put it in the air fryer or whatever. Um, these are pretty good. Seven grams of carbs in that one, six in that one um, per one tablespoon. And of course, you just marinate your meat in it um, and then you just grill or cook the meat. So, you know, it's pretty good. Um, I grabbed some hot dog buns, um, because one night I'm thinking, you know, we could just have chili dogs. So I got some hot dog buns and some turkey, um, hot dogs. I picked up this coleslaw. This is what babe likes to put on his hot dogs. We have talked about this before. Y'all have seen it plenty of times. I'm not a fan, but hey, to each his own. I guess it's like a North Carolina thing. Then I picked up two creamers because we have some Italian sweet cream right now, but it's almost gone. Like literally only like one more use left. So I went ahead and got the great value version. We'll try this one. Um, the reason why I didn't get sugar free is only because Bay does not like sugar free. And um, I'm just was kind of tired of buying two options and it's only five carbs per tablespoon for the italian sweet cream and then i also got cookie butter and it is the same five per tablespoon i don't use that much cream i literally just use like a splash so they won't hurt me and then we both can use them and don't have to buy two different creamers i got some two good yogurt i got black cherry i got strawberry i got um, mango hibiscus i got mixed berry and blueberry now these are mainly for babe but if i ever want one i'll grab one i'm not that much of a yogurt person but sometimes i get a taste for it i got these um the little potato company i got savory herb and then i also got garlic parsley and y'all know all you do is put these in a microwave it come with the little season pack and no these are not keto or low carb um for four ounces is 18 carbs with two dietary fibers so you know it's got some carbs but that's okay these are easy, um, healthy, and like I said, they they can be utilized for quick meals when we're cooking throughout the week so that we don't get fast food. We already have um, some healthy options here. I got a Caesar salad. Y'all know I love salad, so I got a Caesar salad. And y'all, I know y'all probably like, girl, what is this? These, you see, we got two left over here. So when we went to Charlotte, y'all, for my birthday, we ran in Walmart to get some snacks, and we saw these. I have never seen these before, and we got these, y'all. We got one box, and when I say these two-bite brownies are so bomb, I only like them in this little pack because it's like portion control. So inside the pack, you just get two itty-bitty brownies, y'all, and when I say they are so moist and so delicious, they're so good. So when I went to Walmart today, these are the last three boxes, so I went ahead and grabbed all three. They're like two dollars each and you get eight packs of two brownies so they're good for portion control they're good if you have kids and you're packing their lunch or whatever and they're not that bad on, bad on carbs um well on macros so if you can make it fit make it fit um now one pack is 21 carbs so that's a lot but they're only 170 calories nine total fats and one gram protein so if you can make it fit make it fit like y'all know i'm not primarily keto um so whenever i want one of these i definitely eat one and they're so good bay loves them as well sometimes he'll eat one for like breakfast or like a pre or post workout and they are so bomb so if you see them and got kids uh grab these two by brownies i even went on amazon to look for them and couldn't find them so these are bomb got them at walmart and i got the last three boxes so i'll just put them in the cabinet because i had to stock up and that's how you know they're good because it was only three boxes left anyway this was just a little haul we still have plenty of meat we got boneless chicken thighs i have pork chops we got ground turkey ground beef 
Um, we have um, frozen broccoli. We have um, so many sides. So that's why I just got a couple things because we still have food left over. But yeah, this was my little grocery haul. mood y'all ever wake up and just not feel like going to work that's me today i just don't feel like going to work but i gotta do what i gotta do um so i'm about to show you guys what i packed for lunch which is real basic but i'm gonna show y'all anyway so yeah i did make some um french press coffee it's still hot baby sleep so maybe when he wakes up he'll have a cup but um he picked up this Cowie coffee, medium roast, ground coffee. And y'all, this is bomb. This is bomb. We have like hella different coffees here. And this is just the one that I decided to make. So it was good. I had me a cup this morning as I was getting ready to go to work. And I also was editing. So I just had me um, some of this coffee. This is gone now, but I had a splash of this Cold Stone Sweet Cream Flavor this is my favorite one and like i showed y'all in a previous clip um i got two different creamers from walmart which are not sugar-free only because babe drinks coffee as well and i didn't want to have to like pick up sugar-free not sugar-free so i just got the regular um because i just use a splash so it's all good and then um i put in some of my sugar-free caramel that y'all know i use all the time so yeah that's what i had this morning and now i'm gonna show you guys what i packed for lunch so in my lunch bag i just have a bottle of water i have a mixed berry powerade my glass jar and then i packed a salad so in yesterday's video i showed y'all some groceries i got and i had picked up a chopped salad a chopped caesar salad kit so yeah, I just packed that. So here are the croutons, the dressing, and the cheese. And then in this bowl, I just put the salad. And then I just have some forks and stuff like that. So basic as hell, but it's all good. And then um, I'm also going to throw in a pack of these brownies. I showed y'all these brownies yesterday. Peanut free, walnut free, hazelnut free cashew free pistachio free and it's like 100 calories so i'll just throw that in my bag as well and now i'm about to go ahead and put on my work clothes and get on the road so i will see you guys in the next clip mm -hmm. all right y'all so for sunday dinner i'm about to go to this little spot called tickle my ribs barbecue y'all this barbecue listen listen linda this barbecue is so dang on good babe and i had it one time um one sunday after church and listen it was so good so i'm about to go in here no this is not gonna be keto or nothing like that i'm about to go in here and get us some food and y'all know i'm transparent so i'm gonna show y'all everything i get but yeah it's called tickle my ribs i think it's just in north carolina but check and see if y'all have it because baby when i say bussing 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 but anyway let me go in here and get the food and i'll show y'all what we got when we get out All right, y'all. So made it home, and I'm just gonna I'm just gonna show you guys a dinner, um, y'all. Like I said, it's from a place called Tickle My Ribs, and y'all. Let me just show y'all what I got. So I got the two meat combo, and I love brisket. So I got the shredded, um, chopped brisket as well as the sliced brisket, um, and then it I, I picked the baked beans and mac and cheese. And they all come with hush puppies. Y'all, I'm about to smash because I'm so hungry. And then Babe ended up getting wings, ribs, 
hush puppies and then he also got baked beans and mac and cheese so we're about to eat this is our sunday dinner fresh off work i'm at home it's pouring down raining so i'm about to eat i'm about to drink a seven up zero and yeah hope you guys enjoyed this video y'all cannot tell me this food does not look good and yeah it's mostly proteins but of course um i do have some baked beans and some mac and cheese that i'm gonna eat and i got um just like a light barbecue sauce on it as you guys can see it's not that much sauce so it's actually just a protein focus meal and then babe got wings ribs and mac and cheese too so i'm gonna eat i love y'all hope you guys enjoyed this video y'all let me know down below if you've been struggling posting content let's talk in the comments and i'll see you guys later deuces